Kia ora tamariki, it's Mrs Flynn here and I'm so excited to be here once again and today I've come to talk to you about something really cool and they are called noticing glasses. Now when you put on these awesome glasses, you begin to notice things around you and I don't mean you notice those yummy cookies on the bench or you notice those toys in the shop that you'd like to buy. These noticing glasses are really special because they help you to notice others around you and to notice when maybe someone needs help or to notice when you can do something kind for somebody. And I want to tell you a story about two girls that I know that have fantastic noticing glasses. You can't really see them because when we have noticing glasses, it's more about noticing in our brain. Well, the first little girl I want to tell you about is a lovely little girl named Bella. And do you know what? She always has her noticing glasses on. One day, we were at the swimming pools. And we were there for swimming, for school. And it gets really busy at the swimming pools. I'm sure lots of you go to the swimming pools. Well, we can't at the moment, but when we used to be able to go to the swimming pools. Well, we were there one day with swimming and we had to go to the toilet. A whole lot of, of students needed to go to the toilet and off we went and we lined up. And do you know what I noticed? This little girl, Bella, she was the first in line she noticed somebody else who needed to go to the toilet and do you know what this little friend Bella did? She stepped back and she didn't know that I had my noticing glasses on and she stepped back and she let her little friend go to the toilet first. Now you might not think that that is a big deal but do you know what? Every time we notice somebody that we can be kind to or we can put, put them first, do you know what? Every time we do that, we grow a little bit more like Jesus. And my friend Bella, she's really good at noticing. And do you know what? I notice that she grows more like Jesus every day. And then I had another little friend and her name was Maddie. And do you know what I used to notice? Maddie always had her noticing glasses on when there would be a group of friends and one person was on the outside and there was a whole lot of friends. You know at school when all your friends gather together and maybe you're looking at something and there might be somebody on the outside who would really like to join in but doesn't know how. Well, my friend Maddie, she would always notice. And do you know what she used to say? She'd go, Hey friend, come and join in. Come and be part of our group. I just loved that she would notice when other people needed to be included. Do you know what? Jesus wants us to have noticing glasses on. He doesn't want us to notice things for ourselves, but he wants to, us to notice when other people need help, when other people need a friend. And do you know what? When we notice those little things, us to grow more like Jesus every day. So do you know what I'd love you to do? I would love you to get your noticing glasses and to put them on and see how many things you can notice this week. How many ways you can notice to put others first. And do you know what I think? I think you're going to be super at noticing and sharing Jesus. Have a great week everybody and I look forward to seeing some of you at school and some of you at church. You take care and don't forget, put on your super noticing glasses. Kaki